Hi, how are you doing? In this video, we're going to explain how to work with the timeline project. For uh, the timeline project, you're asked to create a historical timeline, uh, explaining any topic. For example, um, a music, an instrument, history, uh, a biography of one of the celebrities, uh, a biography for a scientist, for um, like um, a writer, and so on. Uh, I'm going to show you an example about Dr. Magdi Aoub. Before start opening Tiki Toki and uh, creating your events and creating your timeline, you need to identify your idea, then point out the main events you're going to talk about. Uh, you need to identify the main events by dates. So here we have uh, in November 16, 1935, Dr. Magdi Aoub was born okay uh, and he was born in the base Sharia Egypt in February 10th 1957 he studied at Cairo University and was qualified as a doctor okay then in September 12th 1962 he moved to London and worked as and so on okay here I pointed out like uh, 10 or more events they will be stories on my timeline as we said in class events will be stories in Tiki Toki timeline so we're going to open Tiki Toki from here search Google for Tiki Toki timeline select the first link then click my account if you already signed on to Toki Toki. If not, click sign in and enter the username and password sent to you on Classera. Check Classera mailbox for the username and password. Okay, here I'm going to select my account and scroll down. I'm going to give my timeline a name, it will be Dr. Magdi. Yeah. Okay. And the start of my timeline will be the date of birth of Dr. Magdi Aoub. It's November 16th, 1935. So set the starting date as 1935. It was November, I guess. Fifteen and confirm the end of the timeline will be the date of today today is 6th of November ok confirm and we're going to keep the background and the background color the highlighted color as they are create new timeline Okay, here we're having our timeline. So from the admin setting, if we if you need to uh, turn off the help from here, off setting. Here we have the title. If you need to change it, the start date we just added, the end date. Here we need to add an introduction for our timeline, and we may add more details or description in the about part. Here I added an introduction for my timeline, Dr. Magdi Yaqub's biography, and I added a description for my timeline talking about Dr. Magdi Yaqub. Okay, uh, I need to add um, an introduction image, so open Google, Google Images. I'm going to search for Dr. Magdi Yaqub. Okay, here we're having different photos for Dr. Magdi Aoub. This one is okay. Open it. Wait until it loads. Then right click and copy image address. Okay, back to Tiki Toki timeline. Right click and paste. 
save okay here we have our introduction if we click here about this timeline we're having uh, the image we just added and and the title of the timeline the information we added in the introduction okay and the description i added okay for the timeline uh, it was added to the about uh, now it's time to change the background of my timeline from setting again admin setting again here we have two options to have a background color or to have a background image um, i'm going to add a background image okay from here again we're going to search for a background image okay this one is okay i guess open it wait until it loads and then right click copy image address back to the timeline paste and save the background of the timeline it changed okay now it's time for adding stories to our timeline the first story we're having here will be Yaqobs was born in Belbeis, Sharqiyya back to the timeline from admin stories create new story the title for the first story will be for example beginning the start date will be the same starting date of the timeline as for the end date we're gonna make it for example 1950 as the second story this one will start uh, in February 10th 1957 so we're gonna make the first one ends before the first one by seven years so here for the end date make it 1950 and you need to select uh, a month and a day make it 16 February and confirm for the information here we need to copy what do we have here okay and paste save now we're having our first story if we need to add an image or a video or an audio to the story Make sure that you're selecting the correct story from media, new media, okay. Here you're going to place the source or the link of the image, the video, the audio from the type. You're going to change the type of the media, its image here. I searched Google for um, Dr. Magdi Yaqub uh, Young so i'm having this one here right click copy image address back to techie Talkie and paste the link here save now we're having the first story created with an image to create a new one create a new story okay this one will start february 10th 1957 so from here 57 10th of February okay confirm for the ending date of the story the third one will start 1962 so we can end the, th the second one on 1960 so here for the end date make it 1960 confirm for the information we're gonna copy what do we have here he studied at Cairo University and he was qualified as a doctor save search Google again for any image okay this one is okay wait until it loads and copy image address back to tiki toki media this time to add a new image make sure that you're selecting the type as image and paste the link 
save. Now we're having the second story with an image. Each story on the timeline has uh, what we call a label or a category. Uh, it's displayed here as event. If we need to have a different category for each uh, story, or if we need to have uh, the same category for some stories, we're going to create a category from admin categories create new category from title my first category will be growing up okay sorry growing up and for the color I'm gonna select blue save now we're going to create another category from create new category this one will be and for the color we need red save now we're having different two categories growing up and education to add the category for the story we're going to open our stories again from stories here the beginning from categories beginning will be under growing up save and studying will be under education and we're gonna save now we are viewing our timeline in the 2d mode if we need to shift the viewing mode to the 3d mode click here 3d now we can view our timeline in the 3d mode okay we are here in 1975 we were having the studying story if we need to move back to the beginning story we can move from here or we can move here on the timeline forward and backward remember using the free account is allowing you to create only up to 200 stories okay maximum 200 with a free account. now i'm done with adding all of my stories to the timeline here we have the first one the beginning and its category growing up then we're having the education or the studying sorry the title is studying and the category is education and here we're having moving to uk and i added a new category named that career here we have another one um, he had his first uh, operation actually an open heart operation and it's considered a career as well here we have uh, another operation for a baby and it was the first open heart surgery for a baby and here we have uh, a story representing being a professor at Royal College and it's a career too. Here we have the retirement and then we have and here we have one of his achievements okay um, an award and here we have another achievement uh, being uh, or sorry creating the um, foundation of Dr. Magdi Aoub in Aswan okay I'm almost done with most of my stories now it's time for creating what we call span span is dividing your timeline into time intervals for example from the story of moving to UK till retiring okay can be in one span so from admin spans create okay it will be for example leaving in UK okay Ooh, it should start from the starting of moving to UK 
still retiring, so he moved to UK in 1962. Okay, so from 1960, 1962. Okay, make it 1st of Jan. Confirm. And he retired and okay retirement retirement and 2001 so the end of the span will be 2001 okay confirm we need the span to be in for example yellow or we can have a different background or a different image for the span I'm gonna leave it with an overlay of green okay mm, okay we need it colored with optional image no leave it with a color overlay and save okay if we moved here we're having the normal background if we start the part of moving to uk okay here we have the name of the span displayed here uh, it will start in january 1962 uh, till august 2001 and once we are here we're having a background of a background in yellow okay if we are back it will be displayed in yellow so this is a span a span is to divide your timeline into time intervals that has a title okay each interval has a title and has a different background or a different color we can change the transparency of the color to be more transparent okay to see the original background of the timeline okay this is same and we need to change something in the setting here we have the spacing if we leave the spacing standard uh, we're gonna see our stores as we're having here if we change it to be one equal space so we're having equal spaces between the different stores okay if we change it them to be for example muscle and three rows okay they will be divided into two or three rows okay if we're having uh, for example uh, two stories at the same time or they are the difference between them is too short so they will be displayed one here and one up here okay and 